Hello and welcome to another incredibly exciting unboxing video with me, Annie, from blogaboutgadgets.com <coughs> And today we have yet another Pokemon unboxing video This time a reasonably exciting one The Elite Trainer Boxes from the new Pokemon Sun and Moon range uh, Two boxes because they've released Pokemon Sun and Pokemon Moon um, Actually, quite a nice update. Um, it seems like we've had the X and Y uh, series for decades, but it's actually only been about three years. Um, getting us back on uh, track with the video games. Uh, they didn't do anything special for the uh, Alpha, Sapphire, Omega, Ruby, or Bamberga, Ruby, Alpha, Sapphire, whatever. Anyway, um, presumably because they were uh, pretty much a re-release of the Ruby and Sapphire games from, oh, I don't know, 10 years ago. Anyway, so following on from Pokemon X and Y and their range of cards, we now have the Pokemon Sun and Moon range of cards. And as with pretty much every expansion that they release, we have trainer boxes. So this one shows uh, Solgaleo, and this one shows Luna what's the face, uh, Lunala. <coughs> um, obviously I've got them the wrong way around, it should be Sun and Moon. Anyway, um, so let's have a look. We have our usual gubbins on the back, telling you a bit about the, uh, the new range and uh, what you've got in the box. Uh, Welcome to the tropical Alola region. Start your journey with all it Lightning and Poplio. Seek out originally Pokemon Solgaleo and Lunala GX. Uh, witness all for power, blah blah blah, etc. etc. So, inside we've got uh, eight booster packs from the Sun and Moon range, uh, 65 card sleeves in each box featuring the relevant GX Pokemon. Uh, bunch of energy cards to get you started, uh, player's guide. Damage counter dice, uh, coin flip die, uh, the usual poison and burn markers, uh, collector's box, and the code for it to go online. Oh, and what's new? A GX marker. Uh, we'll come to that in a bit. Anyway, <coughs> might as well stop faffing around and get these open. Oh, I didn't even go in at all there. Come on, there we go. Okay. So in keeping with the theme of getting around the wrong way, we'll open moon first and then sun. Okay, and appears that just like usual, we have inside here a neat little uh, bit of artwork here showing the two GXs and the evolved forms of Poplio, uh, Rowlet, and uh, thingy, the little cat thing, Litten. <coughs> I'm guessing it's probably the same in Moon. Yep. Right, let's do it that way around. So the artwork there that you'll see on the, a lot of the packs and everything. Okay. You a bit of a packing card. Player's guides. Okay, player's guide basically uh, explains a bit about uh, what the Sun and Expansion does, some of the uh, key cards that you'll find, um, some tips, guides for combos, and of course the checklist. Uh, list of the three pre built uh, battle decks that you can get. And 
what we'll also what it also tells you about is the um, the new GX mechanic. Uh, long story short, each Pokemon, oh sorry, each GX Pokemon uh, now has an additional attack on it. Now if we use a Snorlax GX here, I can demonstrate. <coughs> um, each GX Pokemon has a special GX move, which will either do like an incredibly powerful attack or uh, some like you know put five cards from your discard pile into your hand, something like that. The special thing about GX stuff though is you can only use it once per game. So unlike um, moves from your Pokemon EX or whatever else that you can use as many times as you want, the GX move can only be used once per game and that is why hopefully we'll find it fairly easily. That is why, in amongst all the stuff in here, we should find. Yeah, here we go. In addition to your normal condition markers, this swanky new GX marker. So, when you've used a GX move, you can put that out on the table to show, uh, remind you that you've used it and when your opponent you've used it and actually that is that is a really nice token there it's uh, acrylic, it's got the pokeball on the back and pretty cool bit of GX artwork there and just to sort of put it in comparison size with the card and the condition markers that's quite a nice big marker that, I thought it was going to be a lot smaller <coughs> okay, so now we've already started cracking that open, let's have a look at what's inside our moon box. So here are our four dividers with Pokemon on the front, the Sun Moon logo on the back. Here are our five, six, seven. Here are eight booster packs, our card sleeves, our energy, basic energy cards to get you going, the purple um, health markers and coin flip dice with the uh, nice artwork on there. Any health markers and your code for the online game. <coughs> and pop open the sun as well. There's me eight uh, boost, uh, booster packs, trading card game code. Dividers here, Solgaleo, and again, Sun Moon. This time in a nice bright orange. The purple on these ones is a bit brighter than it looks on the video. Um, it's not neon bright, but uh, it's quite a nice bright purple colour. Um, and Solgaleo's card sleeves with a nice uh, uh, sort of dark chrome effect on them there. And again, NG cards, uh, condition markers, and another GX marker, and orange dice. Okay, so, not a uh, change from usual, with the exception of the, the GX marker. So your straightforward um, uh, trainer boxes. <coughs> Uh, costing around sort of 30, 35 pounds, something like that. Don't buy them in game, they're hideously expensive in there, get them online. Um, so when you factor in, let's say, 350 for each pack of cards, plus, I mean, you know, card sleeves, something like that, that would normally go for six quid at least, probably dividers, annual dice stuff. As always, trainer boxes are providing 
good value for money. Um, your box to store your stuff in as well. So uh, always a good way to um, get started whenever there's a new uh, expansion coming out. Um, I don't think we could finish without opening up some of these packs though, can we? So let's have a look. Uh, what have we got here? Uh, da -da. Let's just sort of split them out into pack artwork. Not that it makes a blind bit of difference to what's inside. Three of them, three of them, three of them, uh, five of him and two of him. So let's start with the L. Okay, so we've got a Dratini, a Sandigast, a Morlal, Formantis, a Skit, ooh, a shiny Caterpie. A uh, Tukanan, a uh, Fighting Energy, a Steeny, a Polywell, a Nest Ball. A uh, Drowsy, Cutie Fly, Skarmory, Bone Sweet, and Diglett, Shiny Dartrix. So here they roll from uh, Roll It. Uh, ooh, a Reverse Crocodile. Uh, a couple of energy cards there, a Puky Muky and Crocorock. <coughs> ah, let's see what she's got. Another Caterpie. Uh, Sandigast, Rog and Roller, Cosmog, Fermentis. Ooh, shiny Big Malasada. Incineroar and uh, Energy, Great Ball. Passimian and Team Skull grunts there. What are they? Your opponent reveals their hand, discard two energy cards from it. Oh, that's mean. Um, let's have a look, see what they're doing with the uh, Malasada. These are uh, from the um, Nintendo 3DS game. You feed them to your Pokemon to um, uh, give them some stat boosts. Heal 20 damage and remove a special condition from your active Pokemon. That's quite good. Okay, nice to see that they're Obviously, uh, making use of the mechanics of the game in the pack. Oh, I see shiny. I see shiny. Okay, young goose. God, I hate young goose. Uh, roll it. Uh, Cosmog. Again, you'll recognise Neppy from the uh, uh, video game if you've been playing it. Get in the bag, Neppy. Lillipup. I've been catching loads of him and trading him. Wingull. Vicavolt. Oh, a shiny Vicavolt. And. Tauros GX, uh, energy, energy retrieval, steamy, speed of work. Right, let's have a look at Tauros GX, <coughs> um, Pokemon that you can ride in the game. So for two energy, Rage. This attack does ten more damage than each damage counter uh, for each damage counter on the Pokemon. That's nice. Two energy for a Horn attack. Mad Ball GX. This attack does thirty damage for each damage counter on this Pokemon. So let's see, he's got 180 health, so <laughs> you could do quite a bit of damage. So if he's got 10 damage on, it, on him, yeah, which would be uh, 100, 100, then if he's got 10, uh, 10 damage counter on him, then he's going to do 300 damage. That's, uh, yeah, so you can see why that's a, uh, an attack you can only use once per game. <coughs> okay, in my... These aren't the first booster packs I've opened. In, my, in the first booster pack I opened, I actually got uh, Lunalea GX. Uh, his power is uh, put five NG cards back. Um, okay, so roll it, Drowsy, Cute Fly, Skarmory, Bell Sweet, a Shiny Spiro, a Muscarin, oh, Energy, a Poison Barb. If the Pokemon this card is attached to is active and is damaged, the attacking Pokemon is now poisoned. Charge Bug. Uh, Herdia evolves from Loop Up. Uh, okay. Oh, I see another GX card. Uh, Sandy Ghast, Rock and Roller, Cosmog again, Get in the Bag Nippy, Fermentis, uh, Lone Grimer, sorry. Uh, Beware. And Espeon GX, a uh, boring energy gold bag like that. Polly well. <coughs> 
There's somebody at the door. Right, uh, Espeon GX. Okay, one energy, Psybeam. Your opponent's active Pokemon is now confused. Three energy, Psychic. This attack does 30 more damage times the amount of energy attached to your opponent's active Pokemon. And it's GX move, divide GX. Put 10 damage counters on your opponent's Pokemon in any way you like. 10 damage counters on your opponent's Pokemon in any way you like. <laughs> so again, seeing why these are one move per one go per game cards. And I see another GX. Sandy Ghast, Rog and Roller, Cosmog, Neppy back in the bag, Fermantis, Grimer. Another Espeon GX. Different this, oh oh this is the um the special one, okay. Uh, shiny Masquerine, Energy, Corsola, Energy Retrieval, Steeny. So, I have a matching pair of Espeon GX. Hey, hey. cool. Uh, okay, Crab Roller. Moni, Rog and Roller again, Ratata, I hate Ratata, Chichu, a shiny potion, another beware, green energy, Dragonair, Poliwhirl, and a crushing hammer. Okay, we've got five, so that's one set of eight boosters open. Uh, Wingull, a Snubble, Karna, Zubat, Pupio, Corsola Shiny, a Ranton, Fighting Energy, How, draw three cards, Dart Tricks again, and Pokeball. So that Howl, uh, How, sorry, is one of the main characters in the 3DS game. Team Grunt are the uh, other baddies this time around. Roll it, Cosmog back in the bag, Neppy. Lillipop, Wingull, Snubble, a Shiny Spinder. Parasect, uh, Water Energy, another big Melsada, a Brion, uh, Crocorock. Brion is uh, my current stage of Poplio. I'm wondering, I haven't looked to see if this is the case, but I am wondering, there must be, there must be a Mimikyu card. Okay, Lillipup, and I see a GX card. Lillipup, Dratini, Wingull, Stuffle, Pupio, a Shiny Wingull, Incineroar GX, right, I can see if I was right. Rainbow Energy, Charge Bug, Ro um, ah, the Rotom decks. After counting your prize cards, shuffle them into your deck, then take that many cards from the top of your deck and put them down as your prize cards. That's interesting. Could be useful if you're convinced that the one card you're looking for is in your prize deck. Okay, so in a Cineroar GX, uh, Hustling Strike, this attack does 20 more damage for each of your benched Pokemon. Tiger Swing, flip two coins, the damage, uh, the attack does 50 damage for each head, and your Burning Slam, your opponent's active Pokemon is now burned, 200 damage, and uh, it's burned. Okay. Doing too badly here, getting quite a few uh, GX cards out of this. Okay, Makahita, a uh, Fero, a uh, Grubbin, a Sandile, a Crab Ruler, a Shiny Nest Ball, uh, a Reverse Gigalith, a uh, Fire Energy, a Toracat, Energy Switch, and Trumbeak. Okay, four packs left. Back in the bag, Neppy. Litten, Cider, Bounce Sweet, Lillipop, a Shiny Brion, a Reverse Sharpedo, uh, Energy, Rotom Decks again, Great Ball, and a Pyakimaki. Diglett, Dratini, Sandigast, Morlul, Thumatis, Shiny Dragonite, Reverse Muck. Uh, fire Energy, Poliwhirl, Brion again, and a Timer Ball. Flip two coins for each head, search your deck for an evolution Pokemon, reveal it, put it in your hand. That's an ultimate pack for today. A Chinchu, a Togedamaru, a Kavana, a Picky Peck, a Sunnile, a Shiny Rainbow Energy, a Cloyster, a Fire Energy, a Metapod, everybody's favourite. Pokemon Catcher and a Gramble. Gramble. 
Okay, and our last card booster pack sorry for today, a Poliwag, a Sandigast, Eevee, Krabula, a Marini, a Shiny Hariyama, Primarina, Energy, Passaman, Pokemon Catcher again, and Golbat. <laughs> right, there we go. So, that is what we generally refer to as a buttload of Pokemon cards to get my XY, uh, oh gosh, to get my Sun and Moon collection started with and GX and dice and markers and boxes and sleeves and all sorts of good stuff. So there you go, thank you for watching. This gives you a bit of an insight into what you get in your trainer boxes, what cards you're likely to get. Looks like you're probably going to get pick up quite a few neppies and uh, uh, the basic ones, um, you know, roll it, pop the lit them, um, and for once, actually, quite surprised, didn't see any Mowbrays in there. All I keep coming across in the game is Mowbrays, and there are none in there, so that's quite good. Probably fun, there's a Mowbray GX. Anyway, thanks for watching.